सब्सक्राइब कीजिए धे आई चैनल को और बेल आइकन को दबाइए लेटेस्ट वीडियो सबसे पहले देखने के लिए In one of our DNS, we had let you know about the drugs India is using to fight coronavirus. In that, we had told you about the drug Etolizumab. It is a drug that is used commonly for skin disorder, psoriasis, rheumatoid arthritis, multiple sclerosis, and autoimmune disorders. Now, the Drug Controller General of India has approved this drug as a therapy for restricted emergency use to treat COVID-19 patients. But this decision has created a controversy due to the small size of the clinical trials and because exemption has been granted from phase 3 trials. In today's edition of our DNS, we will talk about the drug Etolizumab and all the controversy related to it. So. Etolizumab is an existing drug used for psoriasis, a chronic skin disease involving unregulated growth of some skin cells that develop into red patches, mostly on knees and elbows, but also on some other parts of the body. It is considered safe and effective for the treatment of psoriasis and this drug was launched in India by Biocon in the year 2013. Etolizumab is a drug that has been permitted to use in emergency situations. The SARS-CoV-2 virus has been observed to induce an overreaction of the immune system, causing severe damage to the lungs and other organs. In some of the worst cases, multiple organ failure and even causing death. The approval from the Drug Controller General of India is based on the results from the conclusion of a randomized, controlled clinical trial at hospitals in Mumbai and New Delhi. The study focused on the safety and efficacy of etolizumab in preventing cardiorenal complications in COVID-19 patients who have acute respiratory distress. The drug has been found to reduce these complications in such patients. According to Chief Medical Officer Biocon Biologics, the drug controls the hyperactivation of the immune system in response to SARS-CoV-2 virus and prevents morbidity and mortality related to the cytokine storm. The clinical trial revealed that the drug is best administered in the pulmonary phase of the COVID-19 infection when the cytokine buildup is starting and the patient is experiencing shortness of breath and exhibiting abnormal chest images. It prevents progression to the hyperinflammation phase that is the cytokine storm and other complications like coagulation and organ failure. This drug has been used over 80 patients in Cuba and off-label in over 150 cases. The most important part is to know that when the drug needs to be used. So this drug must be reserved for moderate to severe COVID cases with the cytokine storm where oxygen requirements are rapidly going up. The trials revealed a statistically significant advantage over the control group of patients in one month mortality rate. All the patients who were administered etolizumab were weaned of oxygen by 30 days. None among them needed ventilator support unlike the control group that did not get the drug. Some other inflammations commonly found in those patients were also suppressed and these correlated well with clinical improvement in symptoms. The trial comprised of 20 participants 
given the drug along with supportive care and 10 other participants given only supportive care. All the 20 patients on etolizumab recovered while three of the other 10 patients died. Public health experts and some doctors had raised questions regarding the sample size of the trial. Executive chairperson of Biocon responded to these questions saying that etolizumab has been approved in India and since the country is in a medical emergency, it was decided to go ahead with a clinical trial involving a cohort of 30 patients. The Drug Controller General of India has also exempted the drug from Phase 3 clinical trials and also allowed Phase 4 trials that is the post-marketing surveillance. Company officials have informed that they plan phase 4 trials very soon. Now coming to the pricing of this drug, each injection is presented as a 25 mg or 5 ml solution costing Rs 7950 per vial. Based on an average body weight of 60 kg, the therapy cost of a single dose comprising 4 vial is estimated at Rs 32,000. 